Uh, I'm Hugh Lewis of Llanelli Community Heritage um, and I would like to mention the story of the riot as it reached um, Murray Street in Llanelli, coming down from what was then the Golden Lion, past the police station, down towards Thomas and Nicholas, uh, opposite the uh, Tinopolis Film Studios, uh, where the crowds broke the windows of the shop uh, and started to loot it. Apparently the police didn't seem to take much action for a while but when they did come out with soldiers and start to fall, break up the crowds these then moved up Thomas Street towards the Thomas Arms to Bearing Left into Going Road to Bryn Mawr, which was owned by one of the magistrates. This was attacked uh, by stones causing some damage, windows were being broken. Somewhere strangely the police didn't seem to catch up with them. They were waiting all the time. Police finally come up, the rioters moved down Going Road into Hall Street, along Hall Street to where uh, Wilkins had a had an ironmonger's shop. They then attack that one. Again, the police are, only, are not actually trying to break up the crowd, but just moving in slowly behind them. It's almost a following them. Uh, rather, it would have almost looked like a comedy, uh, because never do they catch up. Finally, the crowd moves off back to Thomas and Nicholas's old shop. That was now thoroughly looted. There are tales of people um, carrying away bed, clear linen, um, all sorts of things from, from the Ironmonger shop. Now, it says that the police didn't intervene there but went back to the police station, which is strange because that would mean them going through the crowd to get there or taking a very long circular route to get, get past. It's never been quite explained why the, the police didn't try to stop the looting, always avoiding. It could be they were trying to minimise casualties and just keep the um, situation as calm as they could, could. Or maybe they just didn't know what to do at all and they were playing it by ear. Um, after that, the rioters seem to, have di seem to go and disappear because the action moves back down to the station where a second set of, rac of riots are going on. So obviously it seems that there was no... Uh, ordered or planned of, of actually containing the demonstrations. It seems completely as if they would just got out of hand and nobody knew what to do. Nowadays you get plenty of train, they, they, they train for all sorts of emergencies but these troops, some of them had just come back from Ireland. Uh, well again perhaps they were more used to, 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 to taking a violent action against pro-protests.